I uh, trapped the adult female falcons and then also banded her and grabbed chicks from a nest. Uh, there was only one uh, about 10 days old, or well, 10 to 14 days old chick with a uh, male chick and then banded and a major body measurement. And I attempted to trap male falcons, um, the father falcons, but he didn't dive on me quite good, so I couldn't ca capture with the noose hat, um, which is a, one of the trap. So I'm working for a company it's called Parker Conservations, and Graham Parker he set this project. Uh, the, the the project is funded by mainly two companies, Winita and City Forest, and uh, basically. We don't know anything about um, how many falcons are around here in the Otago areas, um, how well they're um, doing in the pine plantation forest. So basically, we're just going to survey how many nests are here, and then also if we have a, um, identica ident identification of individuals that we can you know, follow following breeding seasons. Uh, so that's a uh, basically just a general survey of the Otago Falcon area and mostly focus on uh, pine plantation forest. At the beginning, I, of course, and I was a little bit of frightened, but as I get hit many times, I realized they won't kill me. So, <laughs> and I got a little bit of, you know, just out kind of, uh, you know, time, but it's not going to be major issues.